Today we are going to solve a simple word problem related to area. The problem goes like this. Find the area of a room 8 meters long and 4.5 meters wide. If you want to lay tiles on the floor, how many tiles do you need? Each tile is a square with 25 centimeters sides. Let's analyze the given problem. The question is, how many tiles do we need to lay on the floor? Given in the problem are the measurements of 8 meters long and 4.5 meters wide, which refers to the length and the width of the floor that we need to lay tiles on. Each tile is a square with 25 centimeters sides. To find the number of tiles that we need, we simply divide the area of the floor by the area of each tile. Since the floor is rectangular in shape, to find the area, we take the length to be multiplied by the width. The length is 8 meters times the width of 4.5 meters. Then, divide by the area of each tile. Each tile is a square. To find the area, we multiply the side by its side. So a side of 25 centimeters times 25 centimeters. Let's work on these numbers. First, let's find the area of the floor. We can't divide quantities of different units. Therefore, the unit in meters must be converted to centimeters. 8 meters would be 800 centimeters. And 4.5 meters is equivalent to 450 centimeters. It means the area of the floor is 360,000 square centimeters. Now, let's find the area of each tile. 25 centimeters by 25 centimeters would give us an area of 625 square centimeters. To find the number of tiles, we must then divide 360,000 square centimeters by 625 square centimeters. In division, we cancel the units that are the same. So the remaining number will give us a quotient of 576, which is the number of tiles. Going back to the question as to how many tiles we need, the answer would be this. We need 576 tiles. If you found videos like this useful, a like would be appreciated. Feel free to browse other interesting lessons on this channel. PDF copies are available on our Facebook page. This would be all for now. Stay safe everyone and have fun learning.